guys, welcome to this week's Urban Uncut, and this week is a special episode. We have a challenge. And we have two judges. I'm, we, I'm not competitive at all. Until, until, it, until, until it's time to get competitive, all right? I'm ready for this. I'm ready. You're ready. Right, so we have two carbon fiber bonnets. Daniel has kindly given us the most difficult part to paint, and me and Lenny are gonna learn to paint and these two guys are gonna judge it. We've got Steve here from Car Systems. Steve, give us an overview of what we're gonna be dressed in and the products that we're gonna be using to complete this challenge. <clears throat> okay, so first of all, what are, we what are we gonna be dressed in is our new overalls. It's a two-piece overalls and camouflage optic. Um, pretty nice to wear, pretty comfortable. You know, yeah. when you stand the whole day in the spray booth, you're, you know, you're, you're sweating and stuff, you know. That was a little bit that was made there. No worries. <laughs> we got a pre-warning that Steve swore a lot, so Good. there might be a few beeps. I'm in from this Germany, episode. so that's the biggest excuse, all right? So that says all. Okay, so when you spend the whole day in the spray booth, you yeah. know, just taking your overall on and off all the time. This is a two-piece, so you can remove the jacket. You're not yeah. carrying the whole dust in the spray booth, so this is quite cool about this. Mainly, we will focus on uh, lacquering, so we will use our five-minute clear. Um, which is especially designed for carbon fiber for transparent buildup. Of yep. course, we can just paint any color on it, but you know, carbon fiber, the real natural, natural look of carbon fiber is just amazing. So we will keep it like that. We'll just spray it and I think then we will see who are the professionals <laughs> and who are the amateurs. I've been challenging, challenging my inner karate kid, you know, on the fence, like that. Like I say, I'm not competitive at all, but all fence. last night for that, three hours. No, that, was like that. that was paint a fence like this. Paint a fence was sideways as well, trust me, I know. Yeah. This is quite yeah. close to a fence. Yeah. yeah. Right, 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 right. This, this, isn't, this isn't the most difficult part. This is the easiest part. We've and chosen. Is, yeah. Okay, right. So we chose the easiest yeah. part. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. Right. <laughs> so can you tell us how you're going to be judging us then? Because I've seen you, I've seen you rip these parts to shreds well, when painters paint them. Well, on the basis of that, exactly the same way. Oh, right. Brilliant. For you two guys, there's no favours with this one. Oh, okay. <laughs> So the bribe of lunch, that didn't, yeah, it, didn't, no, it won't work. No. So we've got a, a, a medium here and then a double XL. <laughs> so yeah, should, no. we get, should, we get, should we get ready? Yeah. Should we get ready? Let's get ready. Well, these actually, look, look, these actually pretty cool. look quite cool. Do I get to keep these afterwards? Because these look really cool. This, um, this takes me back to the 90s rave scene. <laughs> <laughs> I, can't believe this is, I can't believe this is just the spraying suit. Look how sick that looks. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Even in a double XL. I'm not going to say tight, but fitted. <laughs> Come on. We're getting down with the sound of the old school vibe. Keep it alive with my tribe survive. Everybody know we're going to do it like this. So just a, quick, uh, just a quick explanation about what lacquering in general is. Um, in general, lacquering is top coating. Yeah? Spraying the clear coat, use a small nozzle, set a good gun to get a good flow, nice gloss. And yeah. So is there any is there any guidance you can give us on like how close we how close we spray? 100 percent First of all, it depends on the spray gun. Yeah. So I don't know what's your what's your preference. They've got, they've got beginners. <laughs> beginner spray guns. They're little fisher price. Fisher price. <laughs> My <laughs> first spray gun. <laughs> I thought you mean a brush or something. <laughs> no, so in general, about the speed and distance, it's some kind of feeling. You have to adjust while you spray. With the with the experience. <laughs> it's 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 really I'm really enjoying it. But, but it is how it is. It's 100 percent how it is. 100 percent 100 percent This is like telling someone that doesn't know how to drive. There you go, yes. there's a car. Yeah. There's yeah. clutch, <laughs> there's the brake, there's the accelerator. Yeah. Yeah. First, second, third, go for it. <laughs> go for it, yeah. Oh. That's why I will show you guys. Yeah. Yeah. And I will give you a small explanation about how I decide what to do, what is too less, what is too much, what is the right amount. Okay. Again, I guess we will sort it out. Well, I'm roasting, so let's crack on. <laughs> let's crack, let's crack Remind on. me whose stupid idea this was. <laughs> Your idea, not mine. <laughs> <laughs> Pickups are hugely popular. We've seen the success of people that have done the Ford Ranger in the past, and because of the brand, we wanted to do something that was slightly more premium. Listen, I know this shares some things with the Ford Ranger, but it is the VW variant. The interior is nice and opulent, and I think we can do something to this car that makes it a little bit more special. So 
So what will we do to the car? Now, it has to have wheel arches. You can see here, this lovely, big, bold swage line across the top. We can probably chop out from that. We don't know how far we will go out. Will we take this piece, bring it out, or will we take it off and use it as a fitting reference point? One thing I do know is it has to have wide arches. It will form part of our wide track range as well. The front bumper, I think we can potentially take this apart and have replacement bumper corners here. You see this swage line, it makes it really, really easy for us to just replace this component and keep the central like fixings all the same. Coupled up with a nice chin spoiler as well, I think that will look epic. Wheels, I think we'll probably go up to 20 inch. You can see here that this takes the six lugs as well. So I'm not sure on the application yet, but I'm sure there's something we can do on our existing range and basically just adapt the centerpiece. So with the details on this bonnet, I think it will lend itself perfect to a bullnose application. You'll have seen we've done the same on our G-Wagon before. The dips here will just allow us to come up and over and have this nice placement on the bonnet. And with most of our builds, you know on the commercials, they have to have a light bar. This will be exactly the same. Four way or two way, we're not sure yet, but we know full well it will lend itself perfect to a light bar. So the rear of the car, we probably won't do much, to be honest with you. It comes with a fantastic roll bar on there, which is already made out of powder coated stainless steel. When we come round with the wide arches on the back, there's not really much you can do. Maybe a rear canard that comes up towards the bumper, but the back has a functional step and tailgate that comes down. The camera is incorporated in the VW sign, so we can't really replace those areas. So the back will obviously just get the stance of the wheels that pop out on the offset plus the wide arches, which will finish off the car. This one's gonna be exciting. Right, tell me how to do it properly. I and will f him up. I will f him completely. Yeah, just no tell worries. him no not, worries, not, no not what to do. Yeah, no worries. Perfect. But you know, but, but, but you know it's not for free, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to act like I'm not competitive, but now I've seen Cy in there really, really taking notes of what Steve's he, saying. He's really he's into it He's trying to get it. you, though. He is trying to get you. Yeah. Right. I'm trying to remain impartial. I've yeah. got to say, you could be my favourite. Thank you. Off the record. Right, OK. Yeah. What, just for attitude? For, just, for attitude? No, because we're, we're pals. No, we are pals. But we all want to see Simon fall, don't we? <laughs> <laughs> Your colleague paid. He paid a lot, to be honest. How That's much? Like a hundred bucks. <laughs> so. <laughs> right, let's go right. Okay, let's focus. <laughs> That's a good start to be honest. <laughs> the satisfying thought that he's messed up already is brilliant. Are you looking at it? Is he messed it up? Now is the time to shine. Ooh, ooh, too nice. Much. All right. Not bad. I'll be so glad that's over. Well done, mate. Well done, man. How do you think? How do you think you're done? I think I absolutely fucked it. <laughs> 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 Do you really? I think, yeah. 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 It's hard. Yeah. So I didn't consider my first spray that the angle. So I was like that. So it was like, whereas it should have been a bit more on top. So it was more evenly. So spread. so the pan. So it's going on the panels. Yeah. yeah. So you, your panel was like that, and you was going like that. Yeah. Stop telling him. You recovered. I think I've got I've got a new respect for the boys that you know what they yeah. do in there because that's that's not easy. Let's hit it. Yeah, go for it, go for it. See, when you come to judging, just remember, boss, employee, working man, yeah? Working man. So I can charge him more money than you because he has more problems. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just thinking, well, the lacquer we f***ing wasted, didn't we? <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
we're in, we're in. I'm probably a bit quick there. A bit, it looks a bit patchy for me. He's looking like a painter. Maybe that's just a camo suit from car systems. I don't have my glasses on, so I can't <laughs> see <laughs> probably blaming the quality of the carbon component in there, isn't it? I mean, that's not going to win him any points from here if he starts doing that. The distance, yeah, here we go. Good job. Very good job. Urban Automotive, world leader in automotive customization. See, so who needs AI? <laughs> he did Sorry, thing, I'm bored. It? Was I'm bored. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm trying to sell cars. You're trying and to sell and, cars. And I'm the media yeah, but my team dilemma is slavity. Slavity? Yeah, slavity. Oh, that's actually, that. right, so Because I keep getting it mixed up. I keep going gravity by slam, slam the, by gravity. The, so I, now I call it slavity. The company is slammed. The show is gravity. That's right. And after all these months, I've only just got there. But I'm looking forward to it. Yes. But we need to, this, the last couple of weeks. How much space going, we got, Tom? 10 by 10? Or... 10 by 12. So we've got an extra two meters, so it could work. Right, so we've been going, the, the Audi RS3 was given. Bearing in mind this show's tomorrow. Yeah. <sighs> I know that we like things last minute, don't we? So we're trying to think what would fit in the demographic of gravity. So Irish Freezer freezer given. Yes. Yeah. T6.1 on it. Yeah, we're, we're, and we're doing something a little bit special with that, and that's going according to plan. So that's a given. But then we've got one stroke, two more spaces. Should we take the Cullinan? Because it's the flagship, so most expensive, la. My, my, that's my choice. Or I'd, do we take an RSQ8 because it's more focused on that. the target audience. Or can we squeeze both on, Tom? I think it'd be too much. I think three is probably about right. Fun sponge, isn't it? Fun, Fun sponge, sponge isn't it? Come back from holiday. Fun yes. sponge. Gives this it all week, bigger. he's been relaxing all week. Yeah. It's like his second week of holiday, even though he's been back a week. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I I think Cullinan, just because it's flagship, it's 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 cool it got the most attention at goodwood yeah and it's something i think a little bit different i don't think there's going to be another color than there no okay let's um, go with the color then no i think the color is probably the way to go oh and if you haven't got tickets for gravity yet whack the button up there it's because tomorrow there's... it's tomorrow i know Get but this last minute last minute tickets up there yeah it'll be good really good. and we're going to be there tomorrow on saturday <laughs> yeah <laughs> Walking around, saying hello to everyone, doing bits. Doing bits. <laughs> <laughs> See you tomorrow. Uh, is that it? That was oh, it. No, because before <laughs> we sign out, like this is a very, very cool show. It's going to be like two dads <laughs> just bowling about. Like, oh, this is good, isn't it? No, no, like, gonna, all the cool gonna, scene kids. I'm going to pull out my like, trendiest clothes. Oh, no. the skinny jeans still in, or boot cuts in now? Boot cuts have come back. <laughs> <laughs> They've come all the way around. Oh no! It'd be like that. Well. Going, thinking we're all cool. Like Reebok that. Classics of the Burberry baseball cap. I've got a cap. I've got a cap. Yeah, yeah no, don't put that on. No, no don't like, leave that. No, right, we need to sign. We need to sign off. Yeah, we need to yeah, sign yeah. off. See you, up there. See you See at Gravity tomorrow. So right, we are done, and it's over to the two judges <laughs> to make their decision. Steve, first. Steve? Phew! Steve? <laughs> you know... Empty, <laughs> it's still empty pockets. <laughs> okay, so, so, so in general, in general from, from both of you, good performance for the first time, honestly. Um, but I think it was, 
it was pretty clear from the beginning when you just started, then it's more than just like pull the trigger and, sp and spray. Yeah. I will wait with my decision because I'm the guest, I'm the German. So if I pass away here, no one will miss me in Germany. So <laughs> I will let him go first. <laughs> um, come on, Chris. Right, okay. So let's start with Lenny. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm so proud of you for giving it a go. <laughs> well done. In some places, I think you might have used a brush in that front left corner. Without but, any disrespect, he could have poured lacquer on with yeah, a bucket, though. Yes. That's lacquer on. But you're not judging. Okay. Stand sorry, there and stay quiet, please. <laughs> but that can be recovered. Right. I'll get knots bad, I'll get flared back. So it doesn't really matter what you like in there, it's what your product looks like. And that's. <laughs> <laughs> At least he's safe by himself. That's right. cool. Okay, all right. So self-confess that <laughs> Shall we just get this over and done okay. with? So let's move on to Simon's. Oh, uh, do we have to? Look at him. Look how proud he is. It's like it's really, really grinding on me. <laughs> how smug he looks. <laughs> I'm not saying anything, I'm just happy. Are you bold out here, go? You've got any overtime here. I'm coming on the side, don't you? So Simon's is a lot more of a consistent finish. There is one run in the centre of the ball nose down the badge recess. Yeah, I noticed that. But that's no, you had to look really, really... <laughs> yeah, I noticed that. You had to look really, really closely. I saw yours from about 10 metres away in there. So, and he did look like a painter despite the tight fitting trousers. <laughs> <laughs> and he did come out with a little buzz and a little spring in his step. He did actually enjoy it. Oh, I looked defeated. You yeah. just thought, get me out of this boot. <laughs> <laughs> it pains me to say, because I did say you were my favourite. <laughs> I will, I will hail Simon, the lacquer champion of the G63 Bull Nose Urban Bonnet. I just want a second opinion <laughs> from our paint shop manager as well. <laughs> Daniel? 100%. Yeah! <laughs> 100%! <laughs> Right, can I go back to selling cars now? Then? Yeah, you can. Just, I've just got to close this off because I just have to say what a fantastic job they do of something that's so difficult. I mean, I found it easy because it was me. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to say... They, <laughs> <laughs> no, they do an absolutely fantastic job. Obviously, it makes a big difference when we're using all of the, you know, the, the best products in the industry, mm -hmm. you know, the best lacquers. The suit, I thought I was going to be super hot in there and it wasn't. No, it, was, really it was normal, it yeah. breathed well, I could move. Needless to the fact that the trousers are one size too small. Looks cool. But yeah, so <laughs> big thanks to Steve for coming over for Germany to, you know, just to give us this little crash course. But yeah, 100%. top sure. man, top man. It was perfect. Oh, thanks, mate. Thank you very much. Was it a big pleasure? I'm really grumpy. Oh, I'm really grumpy now. <laughs> and before we sign off on that, you've got a, which side is it? Left or right? Yeah. Top so that side will take you straight to the car system channel if you want any more info.